We got this guy. Oh, there's a trip mine. That trip mine was scary, dude. I really thought something was going to happen. All right, we got the UAV. Here, another guy. Nice. Nice. Counter. He did. He looked that way. Oh my god. That was the, the play of the decade. That was the play of the decade. Oh my lord. Alrighty, boys. Welcome back to another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video. Today, we are going to be looking at something really, really awesome in Black Ops 3. Uh, it has to do with the bribe that we recently just got in the black market. Unfortunately, it's not there anymore, but I'll flash a picture on the screen right now in case you guys missed it. Uh, but we had a three-of-a-kind bribe in Black Ops 3, I think running for like three days or so. And basically, all you get out of this bribe is attachment variants. Now, you guys are probably saying right away, it's just an attachment variant bribe. Uh, how cool can this really be how amazing can this really be well actually a lot of the weapons in black ops 3 when you change the weapon and put the weapon variants on uh, certain attachments and whatnot for the different weapons uh, it changes the look of the weapon drastically it kind of makes it look like an upgraded version of the weapons that are currently in black ops 3 right now and there's a lot of cool attachment a lot of cool attachment variants uh, that you can use for the, a lot of the weapons in the game and i'm going to show you one right here one that just kind of really stands out more than the others and it actually kind of looks like a throwback weapon it looks like a throwback throwback weapon that a lot of you guys probably already know about and if we take a look right here at the kn 44 as you guys can see look at how amazing amazing this weapon looks right now okay i'm gonna take off all of these attachments right here we have fmj we have extended mags we have quick draw and stock right so we are going to take off all these attachments this is how the kn 44 looks like right now just you know the regular weapon all that good stuff and you know i guess the kn 44 really is sort of like the ak-47 variant uh, of this call of duty because in basically every single Call of Duty, we have sort of like an AK-47 variant, whether that's the AK-12 or the CAN-44 or the KVK uh, from Black Ops 2 right here. They all sort of look like the same weapon. They all sort of resemble the AK-47. Well, now if I put on the attachments that I had on right here, if you take a look at the FMJ attachment, though, the FMJ attachment specifically, this is how it looks like right here. But if you put on the KGB legendary DLC variant for it, it drastically changes the front of the weapon and really makes it look like the AK-47. Like, this is a spitting image of the AK-47 uh, from other Call of Duties and whatnot. I believe it was in Black Ops 1 and just, you know, uh, Modern Warfare 2. Just, you guys probably know the AK-47. The KN-44, man, if you put on the DLC attachment variants and, you know, it's just, it's just insane how amazing this looks. Like, it really does look like the AK-47 and it doesn't even look like the KN-44 anymore, man. You completely alter the way the gun looks and it really looks like an upgraded version of the weapons that are in Black Ops 3 right now. Alrighty, boys, and here we go. Here is, oh my god, I was trying to showcase the weapon a little bit, and then this guy comes out of nowhere, but here is the AK-47 uh, KN-44 type weapon. It looks absolutely insane, man. Just like an upgraded version of the KN-44. It really is like a spitting image of the AK-47 in Black Ops 3, and I'm just excited to use it, man. We're gonna be playing some free-for-all right here, uh, because it is double crypto keys in free-for-all with the new update, uh, that dropped, uh, this weekend for Black Ops 3 on Friday. Hopefully we can get the win. Oh, baby, let's go. We're only down by one kill. I think there might be a guy right around me. Oh, my. There's no one. Oh, <gasps> wait, he's right here. He's right here. Let's go, baby. Oh, my God. We have high cal on, too, just to make the weapon a little bit, like, cooler. But also, high cal is a freaking amazing attachment, as you guys can see. I'm going to be getting a lot of headshots. We're going to throw up this counter AV. I'm not sure where this guy's going to be. Oh, my God. Hold up. Hold up, ladies and gentlemen. There he is. There he is, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my God. This can 44, though. Dude, it really is the, the AK-47. Oh, my God. Look at this, man. We're already on a merciless. And there it is, baby. Okay. We're going to throw up the talent right now. Scythe. What's up, dude? All right, my talent's kind of guarding me, making sure I have, or he has my back. Hmm. All right, we're going to check behind us. My talent's shooting at someone. Is he in here? Yup, he's in here. Awesome, Talon. You're shooting at people. You're not getting hit, markers, but you're telling me exactly where they are. And that is just amazing, man. Okay, hold up. There might be a lot of action. Yep, right over here. We're going to kill this man. There's definitely a person up here. Not quite sure where he is. Hmm. I hear one. Boom. There we go. Nice, got him. We have a nice lead right here. I love free-for-all sometimes. It's like a hit or miss for me, honestly. I see this guy. He's probably going to come out right here. Perfect, dude. I think I have the stock on, right? Yeah, I have the stock on. What's up, dude? Oh, wow. We almost died. Hello. Hello. Welcome to the... Welcome to the game. Um, The guy in second place, though, is actually not doing too bad. Wow, this guy literally just missed me. 
Come on, yes, we got that kill. I love having the extended mags attachment on also just because um it really like the reload animation is just like a spinning image of the AK. Like when you reload this thing and the way it reloads and whatnot uh, with the extended mags, it really is just like, a spinning image of the AK-47. So let's just watch out. We're gonna pull out the scythe right now. Anyone else over here? Yep, we're gonna kill this man. Kill this man. I wish I could find people. Unfortunately, I cannot. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen. 30 and 8, though. 3.75 KD. Definitely not too bad for a free-for-all game. A, a game type that, I, you know, I really don't play too much. Uh, but, dude, the KN44 High Cal Extended FMJ in stock. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Second game on. I actually changed my specialist. I removed the Scythe and put on the Annihilator, the Seraph. So, let's see how well we can do. There's another guy who's jumped up right here. Uh, th three people just chilling. Okay, awesome. Nice. Yep, I see this guy. Yep, right in there. Uh, yeah. We got this guy. Oh, there's a trip mine. Dude, okay, we're good to go. That trip mine was scary, dude. I really thought something was gonna happen. Alright, we got the UAV. Here, another guy. Nice. Nice. Counter. Hopefully he looks this way. He did. He looked that way. Oh my god. That was the, the play of the decade. That was the play of the decade. Oh my lord. I climbed over. Oh my god. I climbed on the wall. Changed my positioning. And he still looked that way. Oh my lord. Change back weapons. I hear this guy. Thank you. Thank you. Let me know in the comment section if you guys play Free For All a lot in Black Ops 3. I don't know. It's not really one of my, you know, top game modes uh, at all. Um, I don't really go for nuked outs that much just because, you know, I'm not really that type of player to grind nuked outs or whatever. Um, so, yeah, I don't play Free For All too much. I really, really don't. But it is cool that there is double crypto keys in this game mode. Um, you know, it's, definitely, it's something different. I'm not sure if we've seen double crypto keys within Free For All yet, but uh, it's something different. It's really, really cool. I like it. And, uh, you know, Free For All is kind of exciting, man. You're, you're all alone. And every person you see is basically an enemy, so you kind of have to watch out for that. You really, really do. You just have to watch every single direction because someone could basically be coming from anywhere. So, oh, as you guys can see, that wall, that freaking wall, though, or that, that window right there. I think there might be a guy. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lordy lord. We're just going to chill for a sec. We're just going to prone. Okay, I was thinking if someone's going to spawn right there. Yep, there he is. The spawns are pretty hectic. If you get the spawns down for free for all, if you get them down pat... And uh, then, then you can know exactly where everyone's going to be coming from. This guy just didn't even look. All right, we have a nice little lead. I think there's a guy right here. Yup. Oh, dude, I swear. I think I'm pretty sure I'm running awareness on this class setup. And awareness helps out a ton, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. We're going to pull out the Annihilator. Because the Annihilator is kind of fun to use, as you guys can see. All right. Anyone else around here? Oh, we got a guy right, right, right up here. Let's see. Let's see if he comes through. Oh, he came through. Big mistake, buddy. A big mistake. Okay. We got a guy right here. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, my lord. Guys. The Annihilator is freaking insane. Nice. Hold up. We have a guy shooting down, I think, my UAV or counter UAV. I'm not sure which one he was trying to shoot at, but we got the Talon, though. The Talon's going to make sure that our back is pretty much covered. Oh, my god. Yo. Oh, my god. Thank you. Thank you. Two more kills. Two more kills. Let's see. Anyone spawn over here? Let's just pop out. No one's around here. Hello? Hello? Is no one around here? Someone across the map over there, but <laughs> we can't get him. I don't think we can. I don't think we can. Well, guys, I really can't find anyone. No one's, like, around here at all. Oh, my talent's shooting at someone. There's one guy. All right. One more kill. One more kill. Yes! Oh, my God, guys. 30 and 5. 6 KD. This AK-47 does wonders, okay? Wonders, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know why. I just feel, it's, I feel like it's upgraded. I really do. I feel like this weapon is upgraded, and it feels really good. 
and I like it a lot. So, AK-47 in Black Ops 3. Ladies and gentlemen, a drop a like for that. There you guys have it, the AK-47 in Call of Duty Black Ops 3, sort of changing the way the attachments look and make the weapon look absolutely amazing. If you guys find any other weapons that look cool with the attachment variants uh, that are from the black market and whatnot, let me know in the comment section. Maybe I can do like kind of like a mini series here on the channel where I showcase just weapons that look really cool with the attachment variants and kind of, you know, resemble them to like throwback weapons like the AK-47. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, remember to drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys next time.